my guys welcome to today anyways I'm gonna show you this thing I picked up yesterday for um, well I'm gonna pick up more but we're gonna start our own little like kind of obstacle course kind of thing anyway this is what I picked up one big massive tractor tire I have to find another one got it for free so that works out really well there's a couple for sale for 50 bucks but why pay for it when you can get it for free? So anyways, that's gonna be one. We're gonna put it, find the spot for it in the yard and fill it with sand, pack it in, and it'll be like a, a step up of some sort. I also picked up some tires for my tractor. The front tires of my tractor are bald and they're made for, um, especially bald, but they're made for like uh, sand rings and stuff. Well, winter's coming and I need uh, front tires that will grip the snow and these will grip the snow so picked up those today good uh, morning guys welcome to today's video uh, today is Wednesday and we have plans always plans but first Sophie wants to show you guys something all right what do you want to show them so he wants to show you what the dogs do with bubbles Mahali and Daisy eat them. Even dogs love bubbles. Yeah, right. I think now that Penny knows that the ramp is not scary, she's completely fine with the whole ramp thing. Like she's fine, like she's an experienced trailer. It was just the ramp, clearly. They said it was just the ramp. Yeah, now she knows, so that's good. But only problem is this. I really want to, <laughs> she's so cute. She's so cute. So, and so uh, later this week we have plans at the boys barn. Um, that just involves being at the barn. Like we don't, we're not going on a trail or anything. Um, but I want to take her. I want to take her to the bar boys' barn this week. It's a short drive. Do you guys think I could take it? Oh, that's perfect. Oh gosh, Gabby. We're waiting for Gabby. We're late, and she's still not here to take her horse. Penny's already gone to eat leaves. Bubbles. All right, let's do the bubbles quick because we gotta go. it I did it so I set up 
two uh, things of pull up, uh, two uh, lines of poles, four feet apart. Our vet wants us to strengthen Chino's back end by by going over poles and going up hills. So walk trot over poles and hills. Still a little stiff in the back, but not too bad. Chiropractor comes this week, and we also had a massage just to like make sure that he's okay. Because we be extra cautious like that. It's so hard with horses because you don't know. This one's too heavy. Roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. Whew. Uh oh, that is why it's too heavy. All right, four on this side, four on that side. Pylon in the middle, I don't know what that's for. Good luck. And now I need to eat something, oh, I'm starving. Let's just hope that I have something in my purse or in the car. We were in the woods in a random place. Got both of them. Come see my beautiful bay. Come see Sylvie's beautiful bay. Wow, Finn. He's a bay. You got a bay butt. The other day you were talking about how much you hate bay. Who, Sophie? Yeah. Do you hate bay, Sophie? No. I just dislike them. Why? Because there's so many of them. I know what you mean, but I like a bay. Like they're all cute. Like I like them. I know, them. but there's so much of them. You like something super rare, right? You know what I like? Any horse that's kind. Any horse that's kind. Oh. Redheaded yeah, red-headed mares. Anything that's a challenge. No, red-headed mares. Oh, look at that fits. Brandon adjusted it. It actually fits. Do you want to try it, Sophie? He sure. only can use a snaffle with it, though. That's what I've been using. Yeah, she's only been riding in a snaffle, which is why he's been riding fast and furious. Okay, so basically two things I'm going to tell you guys. So one... Um, Finn doesn't ever need to wear a nose band if Gabby, does, Sophie does Western and she does um, Jumper. jumpers with him. You guys know that he was shaking his head a lot and so we took the nose band off and he was good. But if she wants to show in any hunter shows, she has to have a nose band. Right? You gotta have a nose I, band? I wanna show so, uh, the, what, the one hunter show where um, the I, Halloween one. Oh, okay. Well, like you, the costume one. I asked you and you said no, I have to sign us up then. I said yes. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, if he wants to, all right, I better go do it right now then. What are you showing? Crossroads. The two foot, there's a bunch of fillers. 18 inches. 18 inches. That's what you've been showing. Okay. Okay. He popped it with his I think he likes them. Chino, be like, Chino and Penny are so similar in personality. Don't play that. Other, though, other than he's more easygoing. Bubbles. Finn's like, He's like, whoa. He pops them with his nose. <laughs> he looks at the all, all the way to the ground. He's like, woohoo. But he's looking at his stance. He's like, I will run. Yeah, the horses outside are running. Are they? Yeah. Good boy. Did you show Finn? No. All right, let's show Finny. Definitely Chino is a more playful horse and Penny is a, a playful horse too. Oh look, he's gonna get it. Oh, he blew it, he blew it. What are the chances that Finn has to pee every single solitary time she brings him in this arena? Every time. Do you guys remember when Sabrina used to? Yeah, he's like, don't look at me. He has to like be, feel confident. Like he has to feel like he's nervous. He's looking like, around for all the other horses. Like he, he hears Chino coming now, so he has to wait. I swear to God, though, every single time she brings them. Do you guys remember when we had Sabrina, and every time she was in the crossrails, she would want us to have treats, and so every time she would pee in the crossrails, we'd have to go clean it. So we'd come back, and she learned that if she peed in the crossrails, in the cross ties, that we would come back, and then hopefully, she was hoping we would bring treats. So every time we had her in the cross tie she would pee and we go and we clean it and we go back into the tack room and then she'd pee again like she just kept peeing to get us to come back do you think that finn could be doing that like i will stand here and pee 
for a long time. Do you think I could sit on this tire or do you think it's not good? I think it's not good. And I... And yeah, don't video him. And Gabby, don't come up behind Finn. He has to pee and he won't do it if anybody's like stressing him out. This is, oh my gosh, Finn. Uh, no, he needs to pee. But he seriously won't pee, see? Like he won't pee. It, okay, everybody has to be really quiet and relaxed. Watch. See, that's the trick to get Finn to pee. All right, so we got the new Micklum bridle on and we're trying to see and he's doing something new. No, nope. he's been doing that last ride too. Oh, so he's just trying to rip the reins out of her hand. Gabby got a cut. I cut myself on a leather halter. Oh, let me see it. Yeah, you can really see it. <laughs> Are you gonna use your band-aid? She's like, yes, yeah. I can use my band-aid. You only use band-aids if it's like an actual cut and bleeding. Here's the thing, I went and tried to buy Hello Kitty band-aids. Mm -hmm. And they suck? But they don't have any Hello Kitty band-aids, so I had to get the Incredibles. Oh. Mm -hmm. And the Incredibles are not as good as the Hello Kitty. And Sophie got a stitch shirt. Oh yeah. Well, I know what you did to me one time. What? Smell my hand. Oh, it smells good. Yeah, the soap. I love the iodine. Oh, the soap. All right, let's go. We're late. When I say we're late, it usually means that we need to go now, or we're gonna be late, or we need to go really soon, or we're gonna be late. I keep meaning to tell you guys or to talk about the fact that Sophia fell at Brandon's barn the other day. She fell. It was a bad fall, and. And it just, I don't know, I feel like some people just get so worked up over falls and I already know people are going to be out like Brandon and I were having a heart attack, but I just feel like there are so many people that get too worked up and have to find a reason for it and blame people and I just thought it was easier not to show it, not to like show the whole thing. I'm going to try that and see if that helps, helps keep things, the hate and stuff down to a minimum. So you guys know that we took Sophie's dragon, her dragon out of uh, her room. And so we've been trying to like fix things up and get them set up a little bit differently. And we're still working on it, so work in progress. But we got her TV wall now, has got two dressers on it. And we've been sorting through her schleich. I get asked all the time if Sophie still plays schleich. And so I thought I'd give you a little update on the schleich stuff. These are Sophie's dark colored horses, this whole bucket. Well, she did not do good because some of them were light colored. Yeah, some of them are light colored. But anyways, I put all the all the horses in here. These are like a lot of her dark colored ones. Oh, take that paint out. I want that paint. This one? No, the other one. This one? The other one. This one? No. <laughs> Watch this one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So anyways, I wanted to ask you guys who remembers this horse. Oh, this did you paint it or did a fan paint it? I did. Do you guys know who, who what horse this is? It, seems you look like that, which it was one of our horses, so you guys, that's a hint. But anyways, in here there are also a few other animals, not too many. They're mostly horses, but we have a like lion, which is super cute. Show them how big the bucket is. Yeah, so that is all her dark colored horses. That's a big bucket. And then over here are the light colored horses. She doesn't have as many light colored horses, but she has a lot of them. She has a unicorn one. And she has a Finn one. There's a Finny in here. Is this a Fellabella? I don't know. Yeah, I love Fellabellas. But anyway, I think that's what that is. But anyway, these are her light colored horses. She's got quite a few white ones and she's got some fancy ones in here. Super fun to play with. So then in this third bucket, she has some fences. Fences? And some like miscellaneous things like a tire, like a 
barrel racing stuff. Up here, she has all her lit, lit, little random things. Actually, that should go in the bottom. Yeah, she's got like her chicken coop and her dog. I think she's got a dog. Dog thing. Anyways, it's got like all the, all the, this one's got all the little tiny things like all the food and a friend made us these really cute watermelon bell boots. Is it a bell boots? A fan. Um, trophies, pitchforks, like you name it. She's got it in here. Hay, water bowls. And then over in this one is all her people. And I don't know why these crates are in here. They should go with because the... Sophie is a different organized kind of girl than me. And that should go with the jumps or whatever. But And there's lots of jump stuff. Oh, this is her jump bucket and her people bucket. I guess that's what she calls it. She's got like lots of pools. And also all her little tiny animals. So she's got like a collection. Sophie, why are you, why are you throwing stuff at me? <laughs> Throw it into the bucket. Um. So anyway, she's got like, hey, this is... This is the dog I'm looking for. Huh? I want to show that to my friend. So anyway, she's got all these little tiny things, little puppies. Oh, a Dalmatian puppy. Do oh, you have... oh, throw that to me. I have my Dalmatian puppy. Uh-oh. Uh, she's got her chickens for her chicken coop. Her bunnies for her bunny coop. She's got cats and dogs and little teeny tiny cats. I don't know. You name it. You name it, she's got it. Pig. Yeah, I love the pigs. I kind of want a pig. I low-key want a pig, like at the Pasofino farm. Uh, a wolf. Hey, I didn't see the pig there this time, did you? Anyways, and then she's got all of her people. There's one person missing an arm and one person missing a leg. Over here, Sophie has, has been setting up some of her Schleich stuff. So she's got like her, her trailer and she's got her vet. Anyway, she's got a bunch of stuff here, some extra stalls. She's got all this stuff set up. She's got her Dalmatian. That is super cute. Her dog takes over her bed always. Yeah, when I'm trying to sleep, I'm like pushed off of the bed because she's taking up the whole thing. Oh no, room. she loves what she loves. She loves to chew stuff and she loves to be comfortable. She also loves this window and sometimes when it's sunny out, the view from this window is so pretty. It just like is such a pretty view. So that is it. That is the um, update on the Schleich collection stuff. Sophie still collects Schleich. Do you still collect Schleich? Yeah. Yeah, she still collects it. She still loves it. Don't you know that you're beautiful?